restraining order, they're not going to arrest the guy. I wonder how many people actually believe the shit that comes out of their mouth. I don't think they actually believe it, to be honest with you. Maybe we talked about this when we were down in, uh, when we were at the, uh, no, we were at the, uh, the clinic defense thing. Those guys were saying there. It's like, I don't think they even believe what they come here. Because it's not really like they come here. Like, they don't, when you think about Angela, they don't hold rallies for things that they believe in. No. They only ever show up to disrupt our rounds. Oh, yeah. yeah. And that's because I really don't think that they have them. They really just believe whatever they're told. And they're like, they really think in their minds that there's fascists over here. There's people over here that are white supremacists, racists, the scum of the earth. We got every that's what they think race, green, color sitting over here. That doesn't matter to them. Yeah. Because, like, just like when they told Frankie when we were up in Tacoma, they're like, oh, you're just a token. You're a token mm -hmm. black guy for the, for the movement. Like, you're it's invalid, that, basically. That, that's, that, that in itself is on Exactly. 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 They don't see it. There. They see it as they're the ones fighting. You know. And yeah, I don't see a bunch of Antifa there. Maybe one. Well, not either. Unless they're demasking, because if they do anything mass, the feds, Seattle, the feds will go after them. Seattle media don't put up with that. I see these guys. After what happened last year, when everything blew up ago. here. No, before oh, that. Yeah. When last everything time. blew up. Yeah. Well, there's no law that says you I, can't have a mask on. No. But the thing is, they've all they've already been labeled as a domestic terrorist group by the federal government. Right. That just puts them on the bigger hot seat. And, rec and recently, they've had two of their leaders in other cities get arrested. There's no law against them having a mask on. There are laws against them committing crimes while wearing masks. Yeah. Try how they're doing. So it's, there's a real fine line there, and I think that uh, Seattle PD does a great job of controlling that. It's the only thing their city council lets them fucking do right. Okay. Well, I, 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 and, and Mitzi, their chief, yeah. she's got I've her seen their, I've up. seen their May Day uh, protests, and they wear masks and everything else. Yeah, uh, their May Day protests, they get violent. Yeah. yeah. Real violent. I remember when they shut it down over five years, they shut down the entire downtown. So I guess I was wrong. They do have uh, their own little rally. <laughs> It's the only time they do anything. It's usually them just... Uh, they didn't, it didn't do much this year compared to the previous years. They didn't, they didn't uh, well, even in, uh, what, 2017, I think, four people got arrested. There was no damage done Well, 2015, city. Then, uh, it was... 62. Yeah. Bonkers. Yeah. But I think we got a good deal. Yeah, I think the cops like Mayday and the and Antifa likes Mayday because then they get to fight each other yeah. in the streets. They get to let out that aggression, man. Honestly, that's that's really natural. That's the thing. We're human know. beings, man. We want to. The problem is, then it's that people get get caught that up. That is the issue. Yeah. Just like at the last rally, that guy walking home with his leftovers that got hit by the, uh, the wrist attack. rocket. Well, they were looking for somebody. Yeah, right there on the corner. They were looking for somebody to target, and they found a guy. And that's what they did. And then it, you know, and then it blew up in their face. It was like, hey, wrong one, bud. Like, yeah, they nailed the wrong person. Yeah, actually, here, I was talking to him. Was it? Yeah. Oh, it looked like yeah, last time I was up here, when they did that abortion clinic. Yeah, um, a lieutenant goes, well, the difference between up here in Portland is we enforce laws up here. Yeah, absolutely. And that speaks volumes. The thing is, to a point, that's a joke. Because yeah. this is the only thing they're allowed to enforce. Yeah, there's still more than what Ted made. Hey, look, he's looking at the heroin. And, and like uh, last night, um, one of the cop watchers 
he didn't have his camera and stuff, but he was crossing the street and he noticed, he noticed the cop stopped someone for jaywalking. Right? And he asked the dude, what the were you stopped for, jaywalking? Or he doesn't have a jaywalking law. Wow. So the cops trying to ID the guy. All he's doing is running him in for war. Yeah. He didn't know any better. Yeah. So he gave up his rights by giving up his ID. Well, no, he didn't. Uh, the other dude argued with the cop. Oh, he told him. And then told the dude, hey, just fucking leave. The dude left. You haven't committed a crime, they have no reason to detain you. They have no reason to ask you your ID. And then. I'm not 100% on the law on that, but I think the, I think I've read that Washington has a law where you have to you have to open the window enough to have clear communications, but you don't have to roll it all the way down. Yeah. Now they have problem with cars to take you out. Yeah. And, um, well, they create problems. Yeah. They, they, if, they, if they want to search your car, they'll search you. And then last, last night, they stopped uh, seven, kids, seven kids that were walking up the street. They're oh, all that, black, that right? That looks freaky. Stopped them. Huh? That looks fucking freaky as shit. <laughs> when I was in uh, D.C., I watched a plane take off from the, uh, the Baltimore airport, and the way it came across the Washington Monument, I had a, a video, I was taking a video, and it went like so fucking close to it, I was like, oh my god! I was like, I mean, I was... I live up north, there's like, uh, in Arlington, you probably don't know where that is, but, okay, there's like a... Yeah, Arlington's way up north. Yeah, I know where Berlin is. I live in Greenwich, but it's close to Arlington. I haven't been I haven't been close to there since the last time I was there. Anyways, when you're stuck on 172nd, the planes come right above your car, and so it's just rumble, rumble. They also used to live at Gainfield, so it was like the same thing. It's really scary for me. So yeah, what they did was they stopped these black kids, let's say the old kids, probably 14. I had them all sit down on the curb, yeah. talk to them, and then had more gang enforcement on them. Should we leave today? No, they were just yeah. yeah. Right? Then they start filling it out, um, filled by gang in the car, and taking them over to have pictures and take pictures of them. Without, without any representation from their parents there's at all? No parents, no yeah, representation. That's crazy. And uh, Mike sat there and said, hey, you're violating the Fourth Amendment like right. He yelled that at one of the cops. And then within like, I'd say two minutes, the cops left. <laughs> Love it! Now this guy's in a fight here. He's got to back up. He's got to back up. People let him. No, they won't. Oh, this cop's going to come. Big bounce. This out. They had, they had a lot of people Is that on there. the noise you make at night? Let me see that page. <laughs> say no to misogyny. It doesn't even say. <laughs> Seattle had to the stand United against the Washington Group Center affiliated by Cruz. Massive SP present brought up large swaths of solids. Faithfully guarding a crew of fascists making a show of protection on their own. And now gathering for Jameson's police have been off the sidewalk. Yeah, they had the they put this on right after. They said 282 people are interested. Do they have savage down there? Do they have savage down there? Yeah, Jerry Savage is down there. Pretty sure he's actually okay, not allowed to be here. Can you see where all the cops are? No, he's not allowed to. No, he's not. Have you seen the cops right in front of us? Directly in front of us? In that little cluster? He's right there. He's got a black hat on. They're talking to him. Yeah, the yeah he walked right by us. We, had, we have a video of him. Uh, when we were down here, when he first walked up and joined the crowd, we got a video of him walking right past us. Yeah, is, he out, to be is, is he out of that crowd now? No, he's there. He's the cops are talking to him right now. Uh, 
So if yeah, you see the cop, yeah, see the white sign, they're talking to him, right? He's right on the other side of the wall. Oh, okay. He's got a little black beanie on. Take it now? Huh? Take it out. Take it out, that's what you're saying? Take it down. Take it down. Bending up against the wall right now? What are you doing? Yeah. Yeah. So sick of this shit. I just hate that he's doxing everybody, trying to get everybody fired from their jobs and shit. That's crazy. That's just crazy. I can't say anything when we're first doxing or something. Yeah, but we send the papers as possible. Well, the thing is, so, the way that he's doing things, like these, these are good guys. Like, start rallying a protest outside of the guy's job. Yeah. Like, and then forcing their hand. Yeah. Forcing, forcing the company's hand to fire the guy, and he didn't do anything wrong. And they, you know, it's, that's crazy that they would be, that, that you would be able to do that. Yeah. That you would be able to go up to someone's business and put enough pressure on their HR to get that guy fired, even though they have no proof of anything. It's just they don't, the, they don't want the publicity, that's all. No, they don't. It's bad, yeah. That's just crazy to me that they can do that. At least they're kicking a decent beat. <laughs> yeah. But the, but the, yeah, yeah, but the thing, thing is, you don't want to use you don't want to use their tactics. Yeah. No. And stuff like that. You, you should just say, yeah, they're wrong for doing it. Then you do the same thing. They're just scared because if we unite all together. Oh yeah. I mean, they're losing in Portland. They're losing numbers. I do what I wouldn't be to what I wouldn't give to be a fly on the wall for that conversation right now. Jerry oh, Savage is getting grilled by the Seattle. That's community. why I was having my slip knots so I could go down there and just pretend to be. I should. That was throw around a block. They know me. They all, all those guys know who I am. I will. I'll talk to you. Talk about, yeah, I live in Wall's basement. Oh, come on in. <laughs> they got enough cops to run if they want. Whatever. As I say, they got a good, they got a decent beat, but the message is kind of messed up. Yeah, I, I agree with their message. I, I wouldn't like go down there and rally with them. Exactly. Races go home. Man. We don't want any people. We were kind of joking at our last meet up. What if we, uh, what if we all just put on like, you know, all black paint and shit, whatever, just look at their crowd, do some march with them. Wait a minute, who are you guys? Oh my god, man, hey, race is here. Who wants to Yeah, show us him. Let's get him out of here. And then look at Jerry. He's like a lion behind a cage. He's like, I just went out. <laughs> 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 See, even though even though there's a restraining order against them, I I really don't think that uh, I think arresting them would be unconstitutional. This is his First Amendment rights, right? But I don't know. I don't know the line is there because if you're if you violate the law, it's just like felons, right? You have constitutional rights, but then whenever you violate the law, your rights you're basically put under restriction yeah. by by the police, by you know, by law enforcement, um, you know, by a judge, issues an order and restricts your rights because you're abusing them. Right. And so I think you know, if, I mean, if he has a restraining order, right, his rights end where the next person's rights begin. So they would have grounds to arrest him for violating the restraining order, but he does still have a right to you know do what he wants. You know, he does have those. Yeah. 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 There's, that's, but that's you the go, line you, there. So yeah, you can push it where he goes unlawful. Oh, really, goes. Deciding a right, it could be real quick. Yeah. So you know, it's really an you have the option of discretion. I've seen so many times where it goes either way. It's the other. The leader, the other. The doctor right now, the doctor. Yep. See, yeah, he's got the badge on, he's right, he's got the back to the black baby. Yeah, yeah, I know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, it doesn't look like you're talking to him now. No. No. So fucking repetitive. <laughs> well, when you're programmed, that's all you got. Yeah, when you're programming, they're just bots. Yeah.